Hello guys, you are once more welcome to this channel. In this video, we are going to be solving this absolute value in equation. We are given that the absolute value of 3x plus 4 plus the absolute value of x minus 2 is less than 6. And we need to find the set of values of x that satisfies this in equation. To start with, let's recall the definition of the absolute value of x. We know that the absolute value of x is equal to x if x is greater than or equal to 0 or negative x if x is less than 0. Similarly, the absolute value of 3x plus 4 is equal to 3x plus 4 if 3x plus 4 is greater than or equal to 0 or if x is greater than or equal to negative 4 on 3. Or negative 3x minus 4. If 3x plus 4 is less than 0. Or if x is less than negative 4 on 3. Also, the absolute value of x minus 2 is equal to x minus 2. If x is greater than or equal to 2. Or 2 minus x if x is less than 2. This leads to four different cases, and we're going to analyze them using the normal line below. From here, we're going to partition this normal line into three regions using the critical values negative 4 over 3 and 2. Now, let's say here is negative 4 on 3, and here is 2. Now, when x is greater than or equal to 2, the absolute value of x minus 2 is just equal to x minus 2. And on this normal line, this is the region for which x is greater than 2. And therefore, here is x minus 2. And when x is less than 2, the absolute value of x minus 2 is just equal to 2 minus x. So here is 2 minus x. And here is also 2 minus x. Also, when x is greater than or equal to negative 4 over 3, then the absolute value of 3x plus 4 will just be 3x plus 4. And on this number line, this is the region for which x is greater than negative 4 on 3. And therefore, here is 3x plus 4. And here is also 3x plus 4. When x is less than negative 3 on 4, the absolute value of 3x plus 4 will just be negative 3x minus 4. And therefore, here is negative 3x minus 4. But we were told that the absolute value of 3x plus 4 plus the absolute value of x minus 2 is less than 6. And therefore, we have to add these two expressions in each case. In the first case, we have 2 minus x minus 3x minus 4, which gives negative 4x minus 2. In the second case, we have 2 minus x plus 3x plus 4, which gives 2x plus 6. And in the third case, we have x minus 2 and 3x plus 4. And if we add this, we are going to obtain 4x plus 2. Again, from the given in equation, we know that this sum is less than 6. So this is less than 6. This is less than 6. And this is less than 6. Now, this leads to three simple linear in equations. And we have to solve all these in equations in each of these regions. In the first region, we have negative 4x minus 2, which is less than 6. And if we add 2 to both sides, we are going to obtain negative 4x to be less than 8. And dividing both sides by negative 4, we have x to be greater than negative 2. Remember that when you divide both sides of an inequation by a negative number, the inequality sign must change. In the second region, we have... 2x plus 6, which is less than 6. And if we subtract 6 from both sides, we are going to obtain 2x to be less than 0. 
and dividing both sides by 2, we have x to be less than 0. And in the third region, we have 4x plus 2, which is less than 6. And if we subtract 2 from both sides, we are going to obtain 4x to be less than 4. And this implies that x is less than 1. That is, if we divide both sides by 4. From here, there's something very important that we need to do. And we have to draw another normal line so that we see it clearly. This is the same normal line we have above. In this first region, x is less than negative 4 on 3. In the second region, negative 4 on 3 is less than or equal to x, which is strictly less than 2. And in the third region, x is greater than or equal to 2. Now, if we take the intersection of these two intervals, we are going to obtain negative 2, which is less than x, and this is less than negative 4 on 3. If we do the same here, we are going to obtain negative 4 on 3, which is less than or equal to x, and this is less than 0. And in the third case, the intersection is an empty set. As we cannot find a value less than 1, and at the same time, greater than or equal to 2. Therefore, the set of values of x for which the absolute value of 3x plus 4 plus the absolute value of x minus 2 is less than 6 is given by x such that negative 2 is less than x which is less than negative 4 on 3 union negative 4 on 3 less than or equal to x which is less than 0 and this includes all numbers between negative 2 and 0 and so this is equal to the set x such that negative 2 is less than x which is less than 0 which is our final answer thanks for watching please do well to like this video and to subscribe to this channel Stay blessed and see you in the next video.